So the Packers will no longer have Marquez Valdez Scantling. It just came out that the Chiefs have just signed him to a three year, $30 million contract. We knew he was a free agent. And for a little while there, it seemed like the Packers were really trying to sign him, even though there was some interest from other teams. But now it looks as that he will be joining the Kansas City Chiefs a day after they lose Tyree Kill. So this is a little sad as a Packers fan to see him leave. He gets three year, $30 million. So congrats, MBS. That's a, it's a nice, very solid payday to, I'd say, one of the better deep threats in the NFL. So insanely fast. So the Chiefs get him, the Packers do not get to bring him back. I was hoping, honestly, they would um, because clearly right now with the Packers after the Devonta Adams trade, we need some uh, help there wide receiver. Currently, we got Al Lazard, Randall Cobb, and um, we got Robert Tunyon back, but I think we definitely need some more help out there at wide receiver. So um, especially now with MBS no longer being here in Green Bay because it really seemed like maybe the Packers were going to try to bring him back, but the Chiefs are able to bring him back. So MBS goes from Aaron Rodgers to Patrick Mahomes. So no drop off there whatsoever for Marquez Valdez scaling. And now the Packers definitely have some more work to do when it comes to filling Devontae Adams spot, whether that's a trade for someone, hopefully DK Metcalf, Tyler Lockett, who knows if it'll actually happen, whether that's adding a free agent. And then hopefully of course, also drafting a couple wide receivers in the first or couple, first couple rounds of this NFL draft with all the extra draft picks the Packers now have. So Pretty crazy, pretty crazy in the NFL these days with all the, all the moves going down, all the players switching teams. But I just want to come in here real fast, let you guys know the news. If you haven't subscribed and you want to see more Packers content, feel free to subscribe. But thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.